Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Down Pearl. In the last episode we beat the 6th gym leader Byron, the steel type gym leader. And at the end of the last episode I was like, wait, which like is it we have to go to? Because I was reading all of the likes at the end being like front. But it's actually Valor, so that's why I did fly to Tube Life. Because that's where I thought I had to go, so... Yeah. Do you remember? The, there were news reporters in the wine there, but... You might have been wondering, like, why are the news reporters... Like, what are they reporting? Honestly, I don't really know. <laughs> I don't know if really they talk about any, anything, because like, I don't bother talking to them. Because I know that, you know, they're just not going to move. I was little, I talked to him a lot, like, how do I get these guys to move? <laughs> Lake Baylor, just had an earthquake. But yeah, they're gone now, so. Let's have a quick look. Lake Baylor. Okay, so let's do this. The first Team Galactic Grunt. Just had to do something, I was trying to fix the recording, so hopefully it fixes it soon. But, anyways. I think all we're going to be doing today is t uh, the just the like Valor just for the pure fact that I think it bit, seems a bit weird uh, for the thumbnail if I do um, what's it called Valor and Verity I think the next the uh, next like falls or something like that yeah um, it'll be a, a bit weird the thumbnail and stuff so I'm I'm a bit over the top when it comes to uh, making my videos. Like I want to make them as good as possible for me, my standards. But I wish I could make music as good as Nintendo. Like <sighs> I'm like when I'm in music at school, I'm like I wish I could like just pick up an instrument and just be like the best. But. <sighs> I just can't. <laughs> All like terrible at like everything to do with music, so I guess it's not one thing. <laughs> it's because this this music, I just love this. <laughs> just look, like you got these magic cops. If you remember before, this is supposed to be a like. Look what they've done. <laughs> magic cop is weekly. <laughs> Look at all these magic cops. <laughs> what have you got to say? Even Team Galactic has no use for magic cop worthless all of them. <laughs> That's that is awesome. <laughs> I never bother going that way because it's not the way you want to go, obviously. <laughs> as, you, as you just saw but <laughs> Why? Why so many magic cops? Ugh. Oh jeez. Oh, it's me. Yeah, I don't need to take a bite. I'm gonna overplay the I don't get like why Team Galactic always base themselves around poison type Pokemon. Cause like it, I like it, but like why? Why like why not like? Cause this was like Steel Pokemon being Rocket. Why don't they have like ball picks? You know, Honey says like stuff you'd actually want to <laughs> steal from someone. I mean, Tadelli's back. Don't steal, kids. But, like, yeah. I really do like that they are. <laughs> I like yeah, he like shooters. See, anticipation. Yeah, Something like that. I should have used side beam because four times effective. So yeah, if you have a side type move, that'll be good if you use it against Krogon. Or it's evolution, which we'll see in a minute. Here we go, Mrs. Sting's level 27. I want to learn Toxic. Not bad. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, sweet 
content. Can easily get rid of. Just get out of here. Well, there we go. We got toxic. Dun, 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 dun. Pokemon attack. Wait, what? Okay. So let's just. Uh, dun, dun, dun. Let's just start with Blimp. Blimp. Okay, so. Since I'm not gonna do this and the like, I think I'm gonna show off locations we could have done before because we we missed a bit out on a couple of things that maybe like why didn't you do this or something like that. But it'll make sense after this because this if I were to just do this like the video won't be very long. So yeah. <laughs> I thought we might as well use Blimpy, even though I level 35 since the 5th gym, so at least time we use Blimpy a bit more. I remember, uh, well, there's a TM for Shadow War we could have had before the 5th gym. Um, it was on that like foggy route, like Route 210, as a part of Route 210, so yeah, I'm gonna go get that after this, if I remember. Um, yes, if you have a Drift Blim or like a Gengar, if you've done Trade Evolutions, you're just that cool. You're just that much of a great Pokemon trainer. <laughs> then, yeah, Shadow Ball, one of the best Ghost type moves, very accurate, 95 base power, so yes, definitely consider it, especially if you move so awesome. Here we go, fly and then bada bing, bada boo, dust ox is down, yeah like, I guess it kind of makes this day a poison type of one, because like, they're not the strongest, I mean some are like, you know, they are, like wheezing and stuff, from other generations, like stuff like that, but, like, they don't just go around here with like Gyarados, that's like the commanders, and the, uh, bosses. You gotta admit, uh, can be very difficult. The commanders may not be as hard as the bosses, obviously, which makes sense. Like, it's supposed to be like the big boss of, like, the team, like Team Galactic boss. But we're doing, I will say very soon, but we're still about, pff, who knows every episode. I say, mm, six or seven? I don't know. Till we verse him once, and then we verse him again later on. But oh please, I don't want to battle you. All right, we don't have to battle him. So what do you have to say? What do you want? You're one of those new wits who fall from the garden in the entrance. Bleh. It doesn't matter who you are. Well. Okay, so he's just on about battle on City HQ, isn't it? But these lakes, you'll find legendary Pokemon in later on. But this, I've decided that instead of just reviewing or well, not exactly reviewing but telling you all what like move sets uh, instead of just saying the move sets of like the gym leaders I want to do with the commanders like the big bosses as well as Barry which can, you know you can kind of have a struggle with but I recognize your face you're the child who raided the team galactic building in the tourist hmm. Jupiter should be ashamed of herself being bitten by a child but anything and anyone that opposes Team Earth must be crushed. Even the very thought of a po opposition will not be tolerated. Let's go! Team Galactic Saturn, is it a boy or is it a girl? I thought it was a girl, but then again, it kind of looks like a boy. So, leave your comment <laughs> question of the episode. <laughs> is Saturn a boy or a girl? <laughs> but Saturn starts off with... I was going to say her, but genderless creature, uh, <laughs> level 35, Kadabra, psychic type Pokemon, with the ability to synchronize with a move Psychic, Shockwave, Recover and Embargo. So this Kadabra as well as as Kinesis, also has Shockwave, so they're trying to copy us now, oh yeah. <laughs> Not good enough. But no, no matter what, she'll have a Shockwave. 
Maybe we wanna get up, bro. So, I guess that's why she had it, I guess. I mean, a bit of coverage, like, if you had a Gyarados with Bite you were trying to use, that's gonna do a lot. Uh, like, Drift Blim here. Does a lot. But, there we go, Hookadab is down. Overall, three Pokemon. I, I wanna say she, but it might be a guy, so. Is that Bugsy? In uh, Gen 2. Or Harcourt or so, whatever. But. Now it looks like Sans going into. Uh, I'm gonna say her, because it's just easier. Her second Pokemon, which is Bronze or It's level 35. Steel Psychic type Pokemon. With the ability to levitate with the moves Gyro Ball, Shadow Ball, Rock Tomb, Find Fence. You like balls. <laughs> Why did I say that? I was thinking before I say it. It sounds a bit weird now I said it. Ooh. Like <laughs> Gyro Ball, Shadow Ball, Rock Tom. I remember you say Rock Tom. I was little like I could not. My pronunciations are just not good enough. But you may have a bit of trouble. It's not the hardest bronze you come across. I mean, it doesn't have Confuse Right or Hypnosis, so shouldn't be that bad, but Flying Will Mock Punch takes it down. Let me go. Oh, Drive, getting closer. Leveling up. Not about a little. But Mrs. Sting, level 28, not bad. No, her main Pokemon, Saturn's main Pokemon, highest level, Toxic if you think about it like this, this could be like the poison gym leader. Oh, never mind. I was, <laughs> I was like, what gym leader would this be? Anyway, Toxicroak level 37 with, uh, well, poison fighting type Pokemon with the ability Anticipation. It's holding a citrus berry, which is the reason I said it could be a gym leader. <laughs> uh, with the moves Poison Jab, Revenge. Mud bomb bait attack. Now, if you've got a psychic type, you're gonna be able to destroy this thing, but silly me, didn't switch out. That's gonna do like not very effective damage, but still does oh well, decent amount, decent amount. I think I'm gonna go swap into uh, aimbot now. Oh god. Ugh. Revenge does more damage depending on the damage you've done to it when it used it, if that made any sense. Like, see? Level 38 gets one shot by level 37. Makes sense, actually. Whatever. I'm bot. Let's. I go. Four times weak to psychic type moves. So, Psybeam is going to take it down, most likely. Goodbye, Toxicrow. Just like one HP and it's like, REVENGE! <laughs> no, you just use Mud Bomb. You silly squirrel. This is not the last time I'm going to see Saturn. We all have to verse the commanders at least twice so yeah you're gonna see Saturn again even when you're not battling her or him it's kind of like they've done it on purpose like is it a boy or a girl because normally if it's like a male trainer they have like all male Pokemon or like a female trainer then they all have female Pokemon but Kadabra is a male and Toxicope is a female so a little bit misleading. <laughs> that was not the right word for that. Anyway, yeah, even I, a commander, only managed to buy us time. Okay, that's fine. A child like you will never be able to stew the flow of time. Team Galactic will get the three legendary Pokemon of the lakes. With their power, it will create an entire new universe. By now, Mars should have captured the Pokemon at Lake Verde. So, yeah, it is Lake Verde where we're going, so. <laughs> They should fill up soon. It'll be, it'll be very nice. But it looks like these magic cops are gonna die. Okay, I'm joking, they're not really. 
Well, here we go. Let's just fly away. To where should we go to? Yeah, I wanted to show you Shadow Ball, so I might as well go to Celestic Town. Boom! Okay, let's just go heal up. Is that Cynthia's grandma? It, I have a feeling it is, but. Yeah. But I was like, why are you in the box? Bring you to a place so far. Okay, I, I'm, I have a feeling it's not because normally she's just chilling out here. I don't know. She's dead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that got pretty dark pretty quickly. But instead of just going out, I nearly forgot. Let's go see our buddy Gerald. <laughs> oh, I was gonna call him Gerald, but I never got round to doing it. But... Remember Bidoof or Gerald? <laughs> yeah, he's a cool guy. I wanted to give him, give him the nickname Gerald, but yeah, like I said, I never got round to doing it. Oh, girls, the fog. Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> Okay, so let's just let's make our way across, and there we go, and again, there we go. So over here is the TM for Rock Smash, which will be amazing. I mean, not Rock Smash, Shadow Ball. <laughs> we just use Rock Smash. Rock Smash is the HM. I think I'm just losing it. I honestly think I'm losing it. The TM you saw down there, just you can't actually access just yet either. HM for waterfall, I'm pretty sure. So, where should we go to? Uh, yeah, why not? Oh, home city. Let's just let's just go. Everyone on the bike in a while, so. Okay, so the reason I decided to come here is because I remember that when I was doing the Surfing the Seas episode, I did do pretty much everything, but I didn't do around here because I didn't think it was necessary, but why not? Because instead of making the episode really, like, a lot shorter than the rest, why not just do this? Why not just do this? Because there's a trend down here with Barboat, which you'll need for your pop. Yeah! Jesus, this must be a high level. This must be a high level side look. Oh, fave. <laughs> oh, it's because we are. <sighs> you know, we might. Should we just use it for experience? Why not? Why not? Bye, buddy. Aww. We are the same level, so it was kind of expected. Just using it for experience, really. There we go, and we should get to level 36. I'm pretty sure we will. Yep, just about. Ooh, 164 HP, not bad, not bad. But it's a bar boat that this guy has, which you don't really need it. Like to see it since if you we went well we went to the uh, contest and we saw one, but you don't really see many trainers with barbouch, so uh, just in case you, you're worried about oh I don't know if I missed one because I'm not sure if anyone has barbouch in the gym. I have a feeling they do, but then I have a feeling that they don't. So just in case you don't have barbouch in your Pokédex. There's one over here, so I guess this could help, but the reason I didn't do it in Surfing the Sea is because it's honestly not that important. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just not. Alright, Gyarados, whatever. 
Can I say let's just do this? Can I say let's just do this? But I want to actually upgrade the team a lot with uh, TMs. I want to get Mrs. Sting up. I don't want to say up some levels because I want to get the XP share, like, you know. Very soon, Mrs. Sting will be same levels as our Pokemon, so. We're at level 27, 28 at the moment, so. Not, not incredibly far off. A couple episodes and we should be fine. But yeah, I'm thinking about giving Flamethrower to Inferno. Possibly Thunderbolt on Kinesis. Um, Shadow Ball on Drift Blame. I want to get some, uh, possibly Giga Drain on Petal Power. So yeah, I'm not sure. But over at the side, there's Waterfall, so you can get like a team up there or something. There's, there's a Pokeball there, so if you want to do that, you can, do, you can go get it. But I think there's not too much we have to do here. If ever you want me to like, I, re I want to do episodes, I've been thinking about this a while, but I never really got around to doing it, is buy a turn of city round in a turn of forest. There's a mansion there called the Old Chateau, Chateau, whatever. It's an abandoned mansion kind of thing, it's like a haunted house with many ghastlies in so if you wanted to get one that's where you want to get one I don't think you're gonna care now I mean you got six gym badges but whatever there's a legendary Pokemon in there potential legendary but in there which I want to do one of the days but I just never got around to doing it and in Eterna City we got the key item for the Explorer kit which I never really got to explore <laughs> So I did that. Okay, never mind. But yeah, I never really got to use the Explorer kit, which I was going to show off in an episode. But I'm thinking about doing it, but I just, I'm just not too sure when. Mm, yeah, I'm just not really sure at all. <laughs> I, I, I have a feeling I know when. Like, a bit after the 7th gym, probably. I have an idea in my mind, but I just, I just can't really think about it. I don't want to like spoil the adventure, so I'm not really saying anything. But in the next episode, we're going to the Verity Lakefront, also known as the Lake Verity. So, if you're sorry for that, let me know, and I'll see you next time.